from the Association of British Travel Agents says people who booked holidays in Tunisia this summer will either be offered another destination or get their money back. For people travelling who were due to travel to Tunisia up until the 31st of October, they'll be given the option to transfer to another destination in many cases, be off their money back as well. So that's a situation if you're on a package holiday. Now, about 90% of people who go to Tunisia will be on packages, but the other 10% will be travelling independently. And that's slightly different. You need to speak to the airline. The comedian Freddie Starr has lost his claim for damages against a woman who claimed he groped her 41 years ago. Karen Ward alleged that Mr. Starr abused her in Jimmy Savile's dressing room at the BBC when she was 15. Karen Ward said the case should encourage other victims of abuse to come forward. Stand tall, it's not your fault. You might not have had a voice years ago, but you have now. Don't give in to bullies. The Business Secretary, Sajid Javid, has outlined plans to grant automatic planning permission for residential building on many disused industrial sites. It's part of a wider push to build more houses across England. European stock markets have risen in response to the latest proposals submitted by Greece to its creditors. The austerity measures in the plan are close to the demands of the Eurozone, which raises hopes that a deal can be reached to provide further financial assistance to Greece and avoid its exit from the Euro. And an adult humpback whale has been spotted off Western Scotland for a fifth time in a month, compared with the usual total of just one or two a year. The conservation group said it was unclear whether increased sightings were a result of a rise in population size or more vigilant reporting. And that's the BBC News at three minutes past twelve, our next at one. Thank you. Could just be the same whale five times. It's making fools of us. Okay, let us start with one of the greatest bands in the history of the world. No joke.